this session on understanding how you can start your IT career very soon. I am Sridhar from TalentSprint. As you know, there is a lot of changes that are happening in the IT industry. And the way they are recruiting is also undergoing a major change. So what we are going to do in the next five minutes is to look at what are these changes and if you are going to be one of those who are wanting to start your IT career in the next three to six months, we will tell you what is the right thing that you should do to take you to that dream job. Now, I'm going to share a small presentation with you. And from there, I'll explain you a few things that you need to do today and understand for exploiting the opportunities that are being created from the industry. As you know, there are 1.5 lakh jobs that are expected to be created by the IT industry this year. Many of them are going to be for fresh graduates like you, those who have graduated in 2016 or probably 2015. Let's now see what's happening in this industry. Here I am, fresher IT job, emerging trends in the recruitment process. So there are a lot of changes as I told you is happening. Many IT companies are moving away from campus recruitment to off-campus recruitment. Why are they doing this? Very simple. All the students coming out of college, if they are recruited to the campus, comes at the same time for the job. However, the work that companies are contracting comes over a period of time. That being the case, taking people in advance, keeping them in the bench for long is costing them a lot. In this background, what they are looking at is just-in-time resources. Even top IT companies, the largest companies, have increased their off-campus recruitment to more, more than 30%. And small and medium companies, of course, are focusing largely on the off-campus for multiple reasons. One, the top talent is recruited by the big companies taking day zero and day one. And they are not left with too much of top talent to recruit from. So they have forced to look at the off-campus placements. This would mean that you as an individual looking for a career in IT is required to be ready to fight for your job on your own. Yes, good colleges continue to help and they will do campus recruitments. It will continue. But the percentage of people that get placed will over a period of time come down and you should be ready for it. So what should we do in this place? Interestingly, the change is not going to be too difficult for you to adopt. There are various tests like AMCAT, CoCubes, Hacker Earth, which have come up, which create the pipeline for companies to look for talent. More than 3,000 companies are part of this assessment, which are standardized and private. So it is possible as against looking for 20 companies to come, which are coming to the college. It is possible for you to reach thousands of companies which are looking for talent. So we will really explain in the next few minutes what's happening in this. So this is the hierarchy of recruitment tests. There are various tests that are available and let's look at each one of them. As you see, you can see a pyramid here. The bottom of the pyramid where the largest number of recruitment is expected to happen, you have three different tests, AMCAT, CoCubes and Metal. And next level, there is something called Elitmus. After that, there are two more at the top of the pyramid. One is called Hacker Earth and other is called Hacker Rank. Let us look at each of this little closely. When you really look at tests like AMCAT, CoCubes, which is at the first stage of the pyramid, it is largely aptitude based test. 70% plus is aptitude and only 30% is technical skills. And when you go up the pyramid, the weightage of technical skills keep on increasing. Typically, a hacker F or a hacker rank 
looks at 100% technical skills and no aptitude skills are tested with these assessment platforms. And each one of them surveys a specific category of recruiters and has different types of demand. Now let's look at each one of them. When you really look at AMCAT, Procubes, Metal, there are around 8 to 10 lakh people, 70 to 90,000 people take this test every month and 8 to 10 lakh people take this test every year. And typically the companies recruiting from here are IT services companies and their entry level salary is anywhere between 2 to 4 lakhs. So if you are looking at this range of salary, if you are looking at this type of companies, these tests you should get yourself assessed on. Now let's look at the elitness. Here the salary is a little higher, 4 to 6 lakhs. The number of people taking the test is far lower because the technical evaluation requirements are higher. And you will have somewhere 2 to 3 lakh people who are taking these tests. Now the next two we will combine together for our understanding. Hacker F and Hacker Rank. These are coding platforms. And there are various coding challenges which are thrown both by the community as well as by the recruiters. Depending on how well you are getting your points and how you do a particular coding test, it is possible for the IT companies looking for high-end software development jobs, be it for product companies or for that matter the startups which are looking for product expertise. These guys will look at top talent from the hacker rank, hacker earth pool. And here the salary levels are far higher. While I have talked about 6 to 8 lakhs, 6 to 9 lakhs in hacker earth USD salaries, we know that even 30 lakh, 40 lakh salary per annum are offered from this platform. So why are we talking about this at Talents? We are talking about this in talent sprint because of two things. We are here with a mission to help 1 million graduates accelerate their career. Two, IT is our very, very close domain to us. We want to work with people who want an IT job in addition to the banking and teaching that we do. And our focus is to ensure that we provide opportunity using our digital platform for millions of people across the country. So we are here showcasing these opportunities to you and to help you achieve this, we are also in the process of, we are also launching our programs to help you prepare professionally for these tests. Keep looking at the developments at Talent Sprint and you will be able to achieve your goal in these opportunities that are presented by IT companies through standard assessment platforms. I'm sure you will find your dream job soon and we at Talent Sprint will be happy to be part of the journey. All the very best and best wishes for a great career.